Hello everyone, this is Gemini Jets 1975 coming at you with a different video. I'm gonna do I'm doing a video of the Gemini Jets April 2015 releases. Um, anyway, let's get started. First you have the American Airlines 757-200 in the new colors. Uh, there are no antenna on here. Um, I definitely want to get this one. Then the Embraer 170, same thing. I've got the uh, Embraer uh, 170 with Delta from a different company, but uh, definitely would like one for American. And then we've got Delta 777-200LR. This is a really nice model. It's got antenna, Wi-Fi box. I already have a Delta 777. If I could find some way to get rid of it, I might possibly would get this one, but that's a big if. Then there's the Emirates 777-200LR. Whoops. Okay, so you've got the antenna, same mold, just different airline. I already have one, I'm not going to get that one. A380, I'm not a big A380 person. Um, so, more than likely, I'm not going to get this. It's kind of cool, though. we got the uh, Cricket World Cup Expo 2020, but... I already have an Emirates and the plane's too big for the airport. Now this one, the JetBlue A320, you've got the Wi-Fi box, the antenna. It looks a lot like the uh, Velocity models release, but uh, looks like there may be a little bit more detail on here. Definitely want to get that one. And then... You got the KLM 737-800. I don't see the 90th anniversary. I thought it was supposed to be the, the 95th anniversary uh, decal, but apparently not. So this is a nice model, especially if you're doing a European airport. And there's the A330-200. This one looks like it has the 95th anniversary. Uh, with the demise of Mexicana, KLM became the uh, oldest airline in the world. Uh, so I guess they're trying to brag about it now that it's their 95th anniversary. That's kind of cool. Next we have now this one, I do have this one in the Herpa version, except instead of the blue tail, it's got the uh, the mustard. But uh, Lone Star One, no winglets either. This thing has looks like it's got an antenna, and the Herpa one doesn't. I might get this one. I doubt it, but again, I probably have to get rid of the other one. And then this one is. Just like the uh, Velocity release, except that there's antenna on it, and it looks like, um, I don't know, I'd have to see it. Well, the Velocity release is pretty nice. Now we're going to go to 1-200 scale. You've got, got the Allegiant MD-80. I'm not a 1-200 collector, but these were probably pretty nice. And then the FedEx MD-11 here, very nice, no antenna. No Frontier, okay, this is just like the Velocity release, except Velocity was 1400, obviously. We got the winglets here, the Grizzly Bear, this is pretty cool, Griswold, sorry. But... Really nice looking model. I would, if I was a 1-200 collector, I would snatch this up in a heartbeat. 
Same thing with this one. This is the JetBlue model in 1-200. Uh, you've got your three antenna here. I would definitely buy that if I were a 1-200 collector. And then you've got the KLM 738 in 1-200 as well. And as far as 1-200s, last but not least, uh, Virgin Australia. So triple seven three hundred. This is nice. If this were in one four hundred. Um, I don't know. I might get it. And the last model is the one seventy two General Aviation model. I don't collect General Aviation, but looks pretty cool. Anyways, guys, uh, a couple things here. Um, I'm thinking about adding to my airport. Uh, those of you that have seen my airport reviews, it would be obviously to the right of the runway on the 18 inches of wood plank that I still have left. And I would build a new terminal there, all that fun stuff. So uh, comment down below uh, where you would recommend getting a mat that I could add to that and also uh, as far as the April releases let me know what you think of the new releases let me know if you're going to get any of the new releases or what you would like to get uh, basically any comment that you could think of related to the April releases whether uh, something you wanted was not released anything and as always, like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.